July Talk and Certain Father, that is track two off their brand new album out on January 20th called Remember Never Before. Uh, that one features Spencer Crook. What's, yeah. What's the connection there? How'd that are you, happen? Are you a big Wolf Parade fan and Sunset Rev Down and all that? Yes, I think uh, I think Wolf Parade was definitely a band that changed me. Yeah. Big in the two thousands, huge. Yeah. yeah. Same. And uh, we were lucky enough to meet those guys at uh, which was it Hillside? Yeah, I think a so. Of years ago. Yeah. And um, and yeah, and and I think like the Spencer's voice came up as the perfect addition to certain father in terms of adding another entity and another energy and we just kind of like got really nervous about asking him and then just like last we were just like we just got to do it like talked ourselves up and and peter wrote him an email and they actually like had this really beautiful email exchange about the song yeah we feel really grateful to kind of been have been able to when you work with someone and collaborate with them your friendship becomes so much deeper than the small talk that you usually get between shows or mm -hmm. whatever and when we were making that song, it was like, okay, well, we have my role as this somewhat kind of storyteller, I guess, and then Leia's side operating on this kind of counter, and it felt like it needed an eye in the sky, like it felt like it needed a Bowie, it needed like this feeling of somebody looking down and seeing all sides, I guess. And Spencer's voice is something that like Leia's, Leia kind of introduced me to Wolf Parade because she had gone to university in Montreal and like knew that scene really well and for whatever reason I didn't know them too much coming from Alberta and um and Spencer was just always someone I really connected with his his art I think also because he plays piano and the way he approaches music is very um theatrical I guess you know uh so it just felt like a perfect time and again like Leah said we were really nervous to reach out but when we did with his response and each, immediately his response was just like well, what's the song getting at and what's what are you trying to say you know and and i thought that that was such a generous answer to come at a younger band with when when they reach out to someone that they look up to um to be generous enough to have like a conversation about the substance of mm -hmm. it and uh and we got into it i don't know how much you want to go into it but this song is uh was written at a time when a lot of my friends I shouldn't say a lot of my friends. A few of my friends were kind of getting swept up into kind of Jordan Peterson and and male, I don't know, gender um, gender theory when it comes to keeping things regressively how they are and and the backlash of progress, I guess. And uh, and I get really frustrated when it comes to fighting against progress um, mm -hmm. and keeping things the same and the status quo. Because I think that the only way to live is a hopeful way to live where the future can be a place where we know more than we know today. And so Certain Father was about kind of the devil on your shoulder in everybody's life um, that stands there and tells you to play it safe and keep things the same and trying to escape that, I guess. And Spencer was just so generous in like talking that out providing reflections on that and then writing parts that like the first time we heard it, it was like, I feel like I levitated a little bit. I was just so grateful to him. It's like a really special collaboration. It was fun.